Hi guys, welcome to Rajshri Food. This is the Bombay chef Varun Namdar, and today I'm going to show you one of my own family favorites. It's a masoor pulao. Let's begin. Masoor is known as red lentils. This is very easily available, and this needs to be washed and soaked for three to four hours in cold water and drained completely before we begin the process. For now, let's take some oil in a pan and let's heat this on medium flame. While the oil is heating up, let's quickly slice some onions. The oil is heated up. The first thing that goes in are some whole spices. Some bay leaves, sticks of cinnamon, some cloves and peppercorn. Whole cumin seeds. Once these start spluttering, I'll be adding in the sliced onion. A few sprinkles of salt to make sure the moisture of the onions evaporate faster. And a quick mix. Once the onions turn golden brown, I'll be adding the ginger and garlic paste. A quick mix. Once this sautés for a few seconds, I'll be adding in the drained masoor. This is followed by a few vegetables. In this case, I'm using some carrots, beans and green peas. Well, this could be optional as well. Time to add in some spices using some turmeric some red chilli powder and with this I am taking some chillies which I am just breaking in a few pieces. A quick mix followed by soaked long grain rice. I am adding in some salt and giving this a nice mix. Now it's time to add some water and this is the essence of a good pulao. Usually the quantity of water is two times the quantity of the rice. So let's do that now. Give this a good mix and now is the time to add in some tomatoes. This goes straight in the pulao. Give this a mix and this needs to now bubble for the next 10 to 12 minutes or till the time the water on top kind of dries up a little. Now that you see, the water in the pulao has evaporated. On goes the lid and on low flame, you need to keep this covered for 5 to 7 minutes. While the masoor pulao is getting done, let's quickly make an accompanying raita. For that, I'm going to take some onions and chop these very finely. With this, I'm also going to take some green chilies. With this, some tomatoes. All of this goes in a bowl. Topped with some fresh yogurt and little bit of salt or as required. A quick mix and your raita is done and ready. You can keep this to chill and serve as and when required. Off goes the flame and the pulao is ready. Let's move this on to the dinner table. And finally, some sprigs of coriander. The 
मसूर पुलाव इज रेडी एंड आई होप इट बिकम्स योर फैमिली फेवरेट टू